All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Grabbing energy nila dito. Even during commercial break, everybody was just screaming and screaming and just the energy is very, very high. Is everybody excited? All right, here we go. Just let me say, for half a century, Mutia has established a track record in, in crowning outstanding women, thanks to the credible judges who sat in the judging panels over the past five decades. This year is no exception as Mutia assembled a group of distinguished individuals who have the task of choosing tonight's deserving winners. Ladies and gentlemen, allow me to meet all of us, our board of judges. Are you guys ready? Ladies and gentlemen, President and CEO of Organic, Miss Kathy Salimbangon. President of Pretty Looks, Miss Steffi Blair Ong Chan. Chief Executive Officer of Miss Intercontinental, Mr. Detlef Tursis. Consul General, Principality of Monaco, Fortun Aleta Ledesma. The Ambassador of Panama to the Philippines, His Excellency, Ronaldo Guevara. President CEO of CDC Holdings, Miss Elsie Chua. Architect, urban planner, and designer whose projects include Greenbelt and Capital Commons, and among others, of course, Mr. Norman Garden. President and CEO of Hyundai Asia Resources Incorporated, Miss Maria Fe Paris Agudo. Former Miss International and the country's iconic supermodel, Miss. Melanie Marquez. The Ambassador of Japan to the Philippines, His Excellency, Koji Haneda. Last but certainly not the least is a seasoned public servant, Ang Ina ng Pasay, the first woman mayor of Pasay and the chairperson of the Board of Judges. The Honorable Imelda Calixto Rubiano. All right, now apart from our judges also joining us this evening are two exceptional ladies who will be keeping tabs on tonight's pageant. They'll also be helping me out hosting. They're very, very beautiful, extremely beautiful. Ladies and gentlemen, please help me welcome Mutia ng Pilipinas Asia Pacific International 2016. Ganyan Christian and ESPN's Ariana Acosta. Over to you. Well, thank you so much, Mateo. We are indeed feeling twice as thrilled to find out who will emerge as this year's big winners. 